Hi everybody, and thanks for tuning in tonight. Let's get ready to worship together. Well, hi everybody, and uh, welcome to Wednesday Worship Moment. My name is Mike Angelo. I'm the worship director at Poppy Community Church. I almost just said worship guy, because that's how I think of myself, just a regular guy. Um, but thanks for joining us tonight. I, uh, I'm sitting outside. Uh, I thought I'd worship outside just a little bit. I just wanted to share with you guys, this is week nine. I think this is episode nine of Wednesday Worship Moment. And we've been doing other stuff at PCC Online. We've had the live praise and prayers on Monday nights and the uh, pastor check-ins on Thursday, Hello Future Kid Club videos on Saturday mornings. Uh, we had a staff meeting today at PCC and we talked about um, we're not going to be continuing some of these online uh, ministries, if you will, um, after this week. So this will be the last episode for now. Um, I'm really glad uh, for all the chances we've had to worship together, uh, to worship with other people. It's just been really awesome to share these times with you. The hope is, and the plan is, that we are really working towards and getting closer and closer every day to coming back together to worship as a, a body on Sunday mornings. Um, there's a lot of details, a lot of decisions yet to be made, um, but that's where we're headed as, um, as I'm sure many of you are excited to know. Um, and yeah, there's still gonna be people that can stay at home, so our plan is to to stream those services, uh, possibly record them and post them later. We're not sure yet what it's gonna look like, but we are getting close to being back together in some form of worship. So, but you know, over the last couple of weeks, I can't believe it's been nine weeks already. It's just been so great to share some thoughts with you on worship. And, um, you know, I just thought we'd sing together tonight. It's kind of like a become kind of an inside joke amongst the worship team. This Paul Balash song, Open the Eyes of My Heart. Uh, everybody knows it. It's a really simple tune. Um, it's really singable. It's really easy to, to, to enjoy and worship and close your eyes. And everybody knows the words and, and you can even memorize it. Um, it's just, uh, we kind of joke around about it, how it's just, you know, that kind of a song, but we love it. And I just been thinking a lot about uh, the, there's a lot of different opinions on uh, should we have been back together by now? You know, what should we be doing? What shouldn't we be doing? And I just encourage you, if, if you're in that place where maybe you have frustration or uncertainty, which I, I think we're all there at some capacity during all of this, you know, pandemic, um, I just encourage you to turn to God and to worship God and to ask God to open your heart and for God to lead your heart, for God to lead your decisions, and ultimately to give God your heart and worship. And um, that's, re that's really all we can do, you know. The term we use is unconditional worship. And uh, maybe the condition that you were wishing for isn't happening right now, or the condition that would make you feel comfortable, that's the other thing. Sometimes God, you know, puts us in uncomfortable situations. And all the while, all the while, we need to be adoring Christ and worshiping Him with all of our hearts as best we can. I mean, I know, personally, I know that it's it's hard to do that and you can't always do it. So um, I hope this comes out okay. There's a lot of wind right now, so there might be a little bit of a low rumble, but we're gonna do it anyways. And um, so let's just worship together. Lord, thank you for this beautiful, beautiful day. The weather has been so amazing. Thank you for the rain. Uh, but Lord, and most of all, I thank you so much for the ability to freely worship you and uh, for the people, the songs that people have written over the years, praising your name. And I pray that right now, whatever we're feeling, whatever trial we're facing, uh, whatever personal preference or condition is not being met, that we can just set that aside and we can glorify you, Lord. We ask you, Lord, to open our hearts, open our eyes, Lord, open our minds and just guide us, Lord. Be our guide.
Thank you, Lord. Just guide us, Lord, in all our decisions and all of our trials and all of our lives, Lord, and all of our relationships. Just help us, Lord. Help us to see you, Lord. And then my prayer is that if we are looking at you, Lord, and we are growing closer to you and working harder to be more like you, Jesus, that others will see us and they will see you in us, Lord, and they will learn to know you and to love you, too ultimately lord to have salvation by giving their lives to you so thank you lord for this time that we had together we love you jesus christ amen well thanks everybody thanks for tuning in tonight and thank you for tuning in in the past um all of these uh wednesday worship videos um and the praises and prayers and the pastor check-ins and the hello future all of those things are on our facebook page and uh, some of them on our youtube account also so please uh, like and follow our page and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And you can also go to the website, pompeychurch.org, to keep up to date with um, 
all the decisions and all the things that are that are happening I mean things are changing quickly all the time so so my prayer as always is that you can worship unconditionally uh, in the midst of these crazy times and I really can't wait until we can get the worship teams together um, you know the sound booth team together and the congregation and Wendell and Pastor Josiah and Pastor Wendell and everybody we can get everybody together and worship together again and in the meantime I love you and I'm praying for you God bless you all have a wonderful evening